the baby of baby mud snakes. This area is where I caught my first live one and also an area that I stayed at to find them. So this is super cool that I flipped one here. <laughs> He's pretty calm now. He's got his head tucked away. They are something else though. All right, let's let it go. Got a little dirtier than I needed to be. Dug, I don't know, a few inches. Come to find out it was just a couple inches down in the side. My first find, a Memorial Lincoln. But what was nice is it's my first find with my new metal detector. First time out. Well, let's hope today is enjoyable. Another unique find. I'm assuming it's copper or brass. It'll go in my scrap metal pile. But it's my third find. I just dug up an aluminum can. That was entertaining. All right. An old eraser. <laughs> it wasn't that deep. <laughs> All right. Let's go. My first silver signal. I don't think it's silver probably cast aluminum huh. oddly enough just a few feet away from the last hole you can barely see it but it was over there I assure you I found a chunk of that cast aluminum thing huh. <laughs> You know you just had to find one of these antiques. <laughs> I almost want to shoot it. <laughs> oh, well, this one you can't. There's no grooves for it. Hmm. That's pretty interesting. All right. Another penny. I think that's Lincoln Memorial. So we're having a little luck out here. That's two pennies. All right. I might have, might have had a little bit better luck detecting that if I had a smaller coil on. Iron. Some kind of unique nail. And copper. On all metal, that'll make the detector jump around some. Well, <laughs> I guess I discovered what that cast aluminum part was. They must have hit it with a lawnmower. <laughs> I'll clean this off, try to see if I can get some sort of age on it. Looks like something for your teeth. <laughs> All right. You gotta be kidding me. Even in a schoolyard. <laughs> it actually looks like it's got a steel jacket on it. It's definitely got lead on the inside. Unique. All right. Even between all these rocks managed to get a penny <laughs> well 
boy today is the day of the penny they're all memorials but they're probably at least I would say 70s because none of them have been Zinklin so far odd piece of aluminum in the same hole <laughs> I guess you always need to double check well finally found a dime unfortunately I think it's clad but it was pretty well hid in there I'll give it that good find great president Zinklin Well, I moved locations from over there to over here because I saw that, so I thought that this might be a little older area. But my very first signal that I dug was clearly a crusty Lincoln. Oh, well, we'll see how it turns out. Well, at least this time it's not a Zinklin. Ah, uh, but it's still a more memorial. Oh well. It's good effort. Like I said, that 340 is a silver finding fool. The mark on it says that it's sterling silver. Good find. Good find. All right. Another penny. Knocking it out the ballpark today. Having some fun. <laughs> finally, finally found that elusive nickel. <laughs> all right we'll go over today's finds Ugh. all right an assortment of pennies a nickel it's like 70 cents in dimes a quarter Looks like a freaking steel jacket 45 or something. Of course, pencil erasers. Copper. Found this in one place. Found that in another. Another. Your aluminum. Of course, this made me feel that there might have been something out there of age. It's copper. But it's probably a straightened out ring or something. I'm not sure what it is. Sterling silver. That was a nice find. And this was a surface find. Dice that must have had the numbers painted on it or something. Just decided to keep it anyway though. All right, good day today, yes.